Hi, and welcome to the demo where I show you how to download full resolution original picture files from the Sony Image Station website to your computer. Now, when I say full resolution original picture files, what I mean is whatever you uploaded to Image Station originally. What you see here is a low resolution preview that we generated from your original picture file, but we keep your original picture file on our servers for safekeeping. So that's what I want to download now, the full resolution original. And in order to start with downloading, I have two options. I can either click on the picture here to get to the download images page, or I can scroll down and under image options, there's a link called download original. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click that now. And you'll see I'm taken to the download this image to your computer page. Now the first step to downloading your picture is to make sure that the picture that's going to download to your computer is named the way you want it to be named. Now we've taken our best guess and given the image a name here, and this particular name is derived from the caption that I gave it, which happens to be Mmm Chocolate. So Mmm Chocolate isn't really that descriptive of a name for my picture. I want to give it a name that I can remember and easily identify this picture. So I'm going to call this Jerry hyphen with hyphen mug dot jpg and you can down you can uh, call this picture whatever you want to call it um, usually it's pre-populated with what your caption was and your caption may have been something that you typed in or it could be the original file name that your digital camera gave the picture like dsc0012 and so once you're satisfied with the name simply click download now now I'm using Internet Explorer, so I get a couple of save dialog boxes here, just confirming that I want to in fact save this file, so I'm going to click save. Depending on which browser you're using, you might have a slightly different experience, but uh, it should work essentially the same way, whether you're using Firefox for Windows, uh, Safari for the Macintosh, Opera, whatever your particular browser of choice might be. I'm getting another save as dialog box here, and this is just confirming the location that I want my picture to download to. It's prompting me to download to the desktop, which is fine, and the file name is Jerry with Mug, and it's being saved as a JPEG image. That all looks good, so I'm just gonna accept the defaults and click Save. And now my browser will initiate the download. So if I remember correctly, this is a pretty high resolution, five or six megapixel image, so uh, it's gonna take a few minutes to download. It's 4.84 megabytes, and my Browser is just finishing up now. It only should be a few more seconds. And there we go. The download is complete, and now the picture jerrywithmug.jpg has been saved to my desktop. Now at this point, I can either go back to the album by clicking the link here, uh, and uh, that would allow me to initiate other downloads, or if I want to download more pictures in this same album, you'll see I have these little thumbnails here, which allow me to easily page through the pictures in this album. And so that makes it easy to just page through one by one and download as many pictures as you want from ImageStation to your computer.